Butterfly gon' recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out there. Thomas Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire flies. When you start rapping like that. that process, I met the criteria to be selected. But I wasn't. Hove did. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc., etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Follow me on IG. Vada underscore fly. Tell your mama I said hi. I hope all is going well with every single one of y'all out here, man. I'm just, I was looking at the, the, the days and the time, and uh, it's like 26 days from some madness, from summer madness, and uh, Easy to Block Captain is not on the card as of yet. Uh, what are we doing here? All right, so here's my thought, right? So salute and congratulations to everybody that's on it or been picked for it so far. Uh, you got Tay Rock versus Swamp. You got JC versus Sue Surf, and there's a couple of other battles that are rumored. I'm not really here to throw hyperbole in the air. I just I try to speak, adjust the facts so we don't have to adjust the facts and I give you just the facts, right? So shit like um, that, shit like that, shit like that. I, I got word and I've been hearing that easy ain't been booked yet. I don't know what the reason is. Do they need do they need a reminder? Compliments, you think you'd be out of shit. You start bitching. You know why we different? Some of the struggle stories I say, I put myself in it. Mood rings the mood swings. I change with it. You know when I start getting body after bodies? When the coke starts shape shifting. I didn't Of what happened? Your best battle since last year was easy to block Captain versus Chess. We're not even gonna debate that. There's no debate here, you are. There's no There's no debate here. Um how is how how is easy and the reason why I'm even making this blog is because there's only 26 days. So what are you gonna do? Are you gonna wait till people start complaining and then book easy with like two weeks left and don't give them the proper chance to really prepare or really get ready and shit like that? And then we gotta so you don't put them in a good position to succeed, then you gotta book them late. And then if he don't do his thing, then we gotta tear him down too because oh he didn't show up on summer mad blah blah blah. We're not gonna. I'm not gonna do that. If anybody gets booked within two three weeks to prepare and the, it doesn't have the greatest summer madness, they're gonna get a pass from me. Because why can't a nigga get a month? Why can't somebody get thirty days? I don't understand what is going on here. Oh, do they need what? What do they need to figure out who wants to battle him? Oh, you could only get Calico. You could only get John John and Don. You could only get Charlie Clips. All his matchups have made themselves. You could even get Shotgun Sugar at this point. Sugar's calling him out, and I'm gonna make a blog on Sugar because I gotta talk some things about his little, what he been doing recently. But he got four or five people that's calling him out, and he's not on the card. Like, why the fuck isn't he on the card? There's no excuse for that. There's no reason for that. They gotta get this shit together, and it's this week. If they don't get it together this week, after that, you go into the teens. 18 days, 15 days, six, now nah, you can't do that. That's not gonna work. That, that will not work. Um, it, Easy the Black Captain has been on one of them runs. Like, he's been on a run that's so solid, it's comparable to anybody all time. Who came on URL? I mean, you know, the app era is different, but had 12, 13, 14, 14 wins in a 12, 13, 11 wins in a row. Now, I get it that some people may want to break it down and say, oh, we'll do, he lost to this person. I'm talking about stats. App stats have him winning every single battle, regardless of how you feel. Yes, he lost in the tournament to Fonz, but when the battle came out on the app, he won on the app. I'm not saying that the app is the defining, you know, sentimentism. And all these people have their own different thoughts and opinions. I have how I feel about battles with random battles being thrown on the app. I don't care about how anybody feels about my feelings. Those are my opinion. Your opinion about how I feel about something, I don't give a fuck about. And I'm never going to apologize. I'm never going to change it. It is what it is. I feel how I feel. I don't feel like the app is very productive. And I feel like it's only great at showing us things we already seen. Like, realistically. No, <laughs> I mean, who cares? It, it, tomato, tomato, you can call it what you want. Fuck it, I don't care. But anyway, um... So, you gotta start like easy, like, come on, son. Like, y'all gotta get this shit right. You have to get it right. He should be booked by now. Because what are you gonna do? Call him once the fans start complaining or the card comes out and he's not on it. They'll, they'll complain, and then what are you gonna do? Call him 
a week or so or give them two weeks like this should be a no-brainer like I, I really want y'all to jump in the comments because I know niggas watch these blogs but for him to not be on the card or to not be booked you know I heard rumors I ain't gonna hold you I heard rumors about the easy and Cal they said Cal want two mansions a house and 150,000 now I get it if a nigga raises price to too 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 much I can't meet you there you know what I'm saying I cannot meet you there Nobody's gonna meet you at 150,000 for one battle. Not, you know what I'm saying? There's only a few people who's reaching it. I don't know if that's the truth, and I'm not counting nobody's pockets because I know how y'all niggas love to do. Oh, you can't, I'm not counting nobody's pockets. I'm speaking from situationally. There's virtually, and some of the other battles that I heard per se are gonna be on there are cool, but I'm not like, and this is just what I've heard. Trust me, take it what you want. There, I haven't heard of a big, big, big one yet. Like a big splash, like a Daylight versus Lux, or like a big ass battle. I haven't heard of none of those yet. I've heard, you know, some names, but, you know, it ain't easy to block Captain versus Calico either. It ain't easy to block Captain versus Charlie Clips either. Like, what is Clips doing? What is John John doing? John John made a diss record. John John been on interviews. Easy made a diss record. Easy been on interviews. Easy been on blogs. Easy done, John John and Easy have been back and forth. Why this is the easiest battle to book? This won't be the easiest one. Okay, if Calico wants too much, cool. We'll do the John John shit right now. You know, not saying I don't know John John's price. Salute to him, he's a legend in his own right. But I know he would show up. I know he'll bring three rounds. I know he'll be competition. Charlie Clips too. Charlie Clips is a nigga that if they call you too late, I would not take the battle. If they call me within two weeks for Charlie Clips, do not take it. Cause Charlie Clips will freestyle and he can battle, he can use the crowd, he can use people standing around. It's not a, it's not, a, you, now you're going into a, not a, a losable situation. But you would think that Easy would be a priority with what he's done. And I'm not taking nothing away from nobody. I think they said none, none was out there talking about Summer Madness recently. Uh, Stumbles had made a tweet talking about possibly being on Summer Madness. And I've been hearing names of other people, and I'm saying it's no knock against them. None that has worked extremely hard this year. He has literally turned himself into, you know, a, a problem. Like, he's been working for, for a minute. And if he was to get that call, I'm not mad. You know what I'm saying? He definitely deserves everything that he's earned. And if Stumbles did too, Stumbles is an upstart. He's uh, making waves and things like that. If he got a call, I wouldn't, you know, I, I, every year a new, 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 new nigga gets thrown on. You know what I'm saying? I've seen it with Wavy. I've seen it with other mad new niggas. They got that shot. So if he was to get that shot, I wouldn't be mad, but come on. We cannot do this if, if Easy the Black Cap is not getting that call. Easy the Black Cap should be one of the first niggas to get the call. He's done everything he was supposed to do. He's promoted. He's battled well. He's built up his brand. He hasn't been losing. He doesn't look bad in public. He was on the Super Bowl. Shouldn't a nigga, why is people getting calls that wasn't on the Super Bowl before a nigga that was on the Super Bowl commercial? That's all I'm saying. Like, if, if this is this how is this is going to happen? And where, if, do these blogs and shit like this have to be made for Easy to get a phone call, for him to get booked? I guarantee you, if Easy's going to get booked, as soon as this blog come out and some subsidiary ones come out, Easy's going to get booked. And I spoke to him, trust me. I know he don't have a battle. I'm not just pulling this out of an act. I know he doesn't have a battle yet. And I'm asking why. Like, and I know the fans want to see it. He had your best battle since last year. You have not put together a better battle than Easy to Block Captain versus Chess. There is not one. Now, there's been some other good ones. You know, Rock and Twerk was a good battle. And there were some other battles that were good. But when you look at the best one, I'm talking about the best. I'm not saying better. The best one was, you know, I got bodies after body when the coke starts shape shifting. Give the fans what they want, is all I'm saying. Because the fans want to see Easy to Block Captain versus somebody on some event. You know? And I don't even think it should be a song, dance, and parade for that to happen. I think it should be a bold of appreciation. Like, we appreciate what you're doing. You know, you've been working hard. You know, boom. Get this. Let's, let's make this work. And it's the show anyway. You want to see the show. You want to see the best names on, on the biggest card. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got JC and Surf. Surf is, is Surf. He do what he do. JC is JC. JC just won 120 racks. And I've seen people complain like, oh, he didn't give none to Swamp. I didn't hear this was a charity. I didn't hear it was one. I did not. Like, if he chooses to, 
or chose to, that's one thing. But it was nothing. If if the if the niggas was giving out the money, wanted to give him something, they would have gave it to him. But you can't expect your opponent. Your opponent could be like, no, nah, your opponent probably got manager. He got family. He got all kind of people that was there helping him get to that hundred twenty thousand dollar platform. When you get there, nigga, I, I don't see niggas in the finals giving niggas on the losing team money. Shit just don't happen like that. So I'm not mad at that. Um, but what I will say is, uh. This is, a, I, this is a conversation starter. Like, should the simple question is answer below. Should Easy to Block have to be on Summer Madness? Yes or no? And if so, versus whom? You know what I'm saying? Who do you want to see? Because at this point, it's looking, if he don't get booked this week, if he's not booked this week, he's probably not going to be on. Now, will it be the end? No, it's not the end all be all, but it's just a slight, like, bruh, what is this nigga not done? What is in, what, what, what are we doing here? You know what I mean? And I get it that, you know, sometimes they'll try to be like, oh, you know, you, you up your heads up here. They try to humble you and bring you down a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I've even heard rumblings of a two on two. No, 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 no. I heard rumblings. You know what I'm saying? I heard rumblings out there. They want niggas to do a two on I said, no. I, I'll be like, no. I, nope, 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 nope. I've heard the rumblings. Don't know if it's true or not, but I'm just saying, I would want a solo battle. <laughs> I'm just saying. I didn't speak to anybody about it, but heard from someone, someone else that that's what they wanted him to do. I hope that's not the case, because if it is, absolutely not. And get the fucking, get this nigga some time to prepare. Like, yo, it's 26 fucking days right now. Niggas ain't got the money, caffeine ain't got the, what was the budget? You niggas ain't got the bread, pay this nigga, pay whoever he's gonna battle, and get this shit booked. Other niggas had two weeks already, rocking and swapping these niggas, they shit got announced fucking a week or so ago. This nigga deserves the same preparation time as the next nigga. You booking a nigga with two weeks, and then if you go up there and don't do good, then what happens? Oh, we gotta tear him down. I'm not gonna do it, bro. I promise you, I'm not. Because I feel like 30 days should be the bare minimum. A nigga should get 30 days. You can't call goods with 26 days and get him to do it. He's gonna say no. You can't get jazz. You can't get a lot of niggas with this amount of time. This right here is short. Three weeks is not a lot of time. Get it together. Get this shit right, because it ain't right now. 